hello hello and welcome to my channel my name is Kat I am the nurse flipper if you are new here this is a resellers channel I show what I sold on different online platforms such as eBay Mercari and Poshmark and I actually have 26 items already going out for Monday but I'm not going to show those because I don't ship on Saturdays so watch for that video on Monday as well as the 1,000 subscriber giveaway. So if you haven't entered that, watch my last video and enter to win. So today's video, we're going to look at some of the stuff that I'm listing now. And I'm going to kind of go over how I decide whether or not I'm going to sell something as an individual piece or in a lot. So let's take a look. All right, so I have some blue willow china here. I did buy this for my friend Pepper. I think we decided on like 40 bucks or something. So here you can see this says that this is a three piece set. So I'm gonna do a screen share with you guys and kind of show you um, what I'm looking at. So let's look up this three piece set here first. All right, guys, so first to look it up, I am going to scan the barcode that you just saw on the bottom. So let's do that and see if anything comes up. All right, so it looks like here um, there are several listed, $11.99, $25. So there are 12 of them listed. Some of them are more. Um, this one says it's four of them. So let's look at what sold. So we're going to go to filter and we'll go down to sold items. So it looks like only this one has sold here. Sometimes they've sold multiples, but it looks like this person only had one. So they're sold for $14.99 plus shipping. So, ah. So what I'm going to do, let's go back to that, is somebody's got them for $11.99, two sets for $25, so four sets for $40, hmm. so I have, it looks like I have five of these. So I think what I'm going to do is list them individually at $19.99. I do have a 40% off sale going on right now. So that will drop them down to $12 plus shipping. And I will make a quantity of five available. And the only reason why is because the only one that sold was individual. And that way they can get one. Or if they want more, they can get more. So let's take a look at... I don't even know what this is. This is some kind of fabric here. Um, I think somebody was just using that to pad. So these look like they have a um, barcode as well. I am not going to want to break these up um, into like because this is two plates. So it looks like I have four of the two plates. So let's look at these and see. All right, so let's scan this one. So this one says no matches found. Sometimes when you scan the barcodes, you cannot find the item. But when we look here, it looks like sets of four are selling very well. They're none listed and two sold. So in this situation, I will probably go ahead and list two sets of two and I will price them at $50, which with my 40% off will bring them down to $30, which is what they were selling for. So now that I know I want to sell these as a set of four, I can go to this listing to where it's sold and hit sell one like this. This will import everything. And now with this title though, you can see 
they have used 78 of 80 so that's pretty good they're sold so I'm gonna leave that the same and then I will take some photos here in a minute they are new and then I want to see they don't have the UPC in here and I do have the UPC so I'm gonna click that and I will scan it with my phone and then I have my UPC in and my custom SKU, I will put Willow Box because I'm going to leave them in this tote. And I'll put Shed because that's where I am going to put them. So there is that in my custom specifics. And if you go down here, I don't, I'm going to just leave them in a blank um, store category. And then I will go here and put a lot of two boxes of two new and leave that pricing so I am doing I do 99 on almost everything but I'm going to do 49.99 because I do have a 40% off sale which will drop that to 30 allow offers and because I have four boxes which is eight plates i'm going to put two because each one is going to be two boxes delivery three pounds i think these are actually probably a little heavier so i am going to put that they are four pounds and the package dimensions really does not matter unless they are going 12 over 12 by 12 by 12. so this says buyer paid make sure that's right I'm gonna go back and it still says buyer paid and now I am going to go ahead and take my pictures all right so I am going to go ahead and take my pictures I do have these in my photo booth and I did one with all of them and then I'm going to do some of just the one up close And I want to do, and I'll leave those boxes in the background so people can see them. And then I will zoom in here to get the Churchill, England. And then what I will do is go to my PhotoFuse app here. And I'll go to New Photos. And I am going to just highlight here the plates and the boxes. and then finish and then i will grab another picture and with photo fuse you just want to grab whatever you don't want um blackened out sorry guys once i highlight that little bit i can kind of just um grab anywhere that's yellow and it'll work and hit finish and then let's see sometimes if this one, I'm not sure how it's going to come out. We'll have to see here at the end. Because sometimes the white on the white doesn't work very well. Let's see and finish. And we're not going to do that last one. So let's see. So now we can click on our first one and you can see how pretty the background came out on that one we're going to save it and we're waiting for the other two to finish there's one we're going to save that one photo fuse is a great app if you don't know about it that's not too bad so we will save that one and now we will go back to ebay and add our photos I don't know why they show up double here, but they do. So we will select those. And then we will go ahead and list our item. And that is it. And my phone is dying, as you guys can see. So we're going to stop here. And that is it. And my phone. All right, guys. So that is two things that i just listed and you can see one i lotted up and the other one i did not 
So when you are looking, and I don't do very many video games, but I had an Atari bundle a few months ago, and the individual games were maybe $5 each. So I chose to lot it up. So there are several different factors that you want to take into account. One is if you have a bunch of lower priced items, then I think you're better off to lot them rather than, you know, having to package them individually, only making a few bucks for sale. You can lot 10 of those up and make $30 instead of $3 each or 50 instead of $5 each, then I think that's much better. So you wanna do some research like I did, look, see what's listed and what is selling. Are lots of that item selling better or individual items selling better? So I did just sell a VHS last week and that um, that one was one I pulled out and then I, lot, I pulled I think one other one out and I lotted the rest of them up. So when you have a lot of one same type of item, check and see because you might be better to do them one way other, rather than the other. And I think that's it guys. So I'll see you guys Monday for what will be a crazy shipping day and we'll do our giveaway. Look forward to seeing you then.